Are you ready for the next recession? It's not a question of if, but when. According to the National Bureau of Economic Research, since World War II, the United States has experienced an economic downturn roughly every five to seven years. That means, statistically speaking, we're due for another one soon. Take a moment. Think about the last recession, the one in 2008. The Great Recession, they called it. It was the most severe economic downturn since the Great Depression of the 1930s. The stock market plunged nearly 50%. Unemployment soared to 10%. Millions of people lost their homes, their jobs, their savings. Now imagine that happening again, only this time you're prepared. In 2020, the World Bank predicted that the global economy would shrink by 5.2% due to the pandemic. That's the deepest recession since the Second World War. Yet some individuals and businesses didn't just survive, they thrived. How? They prepared. They diversified their portfolios, they built up their cash reserves, they tightened their belts. Now look at the data from the 2008 recession. According to a report by the Federal Reserve Bank of San Francisco, those who held onto their stocks during the recession saw an average annual return of 6.8% over the next decade. Those who sold? Their average annual return was just 2.7%. It seems counterintuitive, doesn't it? Sell everything during a recession? But consider this. During a recession, asset prices fall. That means stocks, real estate, even businesses are available for pennies on the dollar. Selling your assets before the recession hits allows you to build up a war chest of cash. Then when the recession hits and prices fall, you can buy those same assets back at a fraction of the cost. But how do you know when to sell? That's the million dollar question. And while no one can predict the future with absolute certainty, there are signs to watch for. Economic indicators like falling GDP, rising unemployment, and increasing inflation can all signal that a recession is on the horizon. So, will you sell everything during the next recession? The data suggests you should. But remember, every situation is unique. What worked in the past might not work in the future. Consult with a financial advisor. Do your own research. Make an informed decision. And most importantly, prepare because the next recession is coming. And when it does, you want to be ready, not just to survive, but to thrive. Now is not the time for complacency. It's the time for action. Start preparing today because tomorrow might be too late.